Hey yo, what's up guys? Today we are here to learn the basic structure of HTML. Let's learn HTML. So, moving on. What is HTML? HTML describes the structure of web pages using markup. Elements are the building blocks of HTML pages. File extensions must be .html or .htm. In HTML5, there are two types, which is WW sorry W3C, which is World Wide Web Consortium, and then there's Web Hypertext Application Technology Working Group, that is what WG WHAT WG. Next, now using markups or tags or elements, using markup tags or elements, use keyword or tag names enclosed within angle brackets. Okay, these are one second. There's a point. Yeah, here you go. Within the angle brackets, we put the tag name and then to close it off, we use slash tag name. So this is opening tag and this is closing tag. Examples would be angle bracket H1 and after you put the header, you close the angle uh, H1 using angle bracket slash H1 close angle bracket. These are the examples and there are these are empty tags which are HR, BR, M image img meta input etc now after this we are moving on to <clears throat> basic structure of and basic structure of html which is syntax and then it has a custom html syntax that is compatible with html4 and xhtml1 documents xhtml rules are lowercase tag names quoting our attributes an attribute had to have a value close all empty elements html5 can support uppercase tag names Codes that are optional for attributes, attribute values are optional, closing empty elements are optional. Moving on, this is the basic structure of HTML documents. This is open, this is the first tag which would be HTML and then head, head is the heading part of the HTML document and then title, title would be HTML document slash title here we are, here we are closing off the title tag and then slash head. The heading part is over now moving on to the body h1 header one which would be html web document slash h1 we're closing off the header and then moving moving on to slash body we're closing off the body body part of the body tag and then slash html we're closing the html file this is an html document and here we can see a x html document I won't waste your time by telling you what is what and all you can see here I've, this is the basic structure so this is just an example you can uh, pause the video and analyze the document uh, for us by yourself for a few minutes or a few seconds and moving on we have this is the HTML5 web document it would look like something like exclamation doc type html you that is the first tag and then html language equals english where en is english we're specifying english as the language we here we have enclosed within double quotes for our attributes and then head where uh, next tag is head and then the title would be web page layout slash title then meta meta gives you the meta character of the metadata of the document and then character set equals utf8 now uh, you, need, you don't need to close it with slash uh, slash meta tag you just put a slash in the end here that would be like the what do you call it an empty tag so next we are closing off the uh, head tag and then we <coughs> we open the body tag in this the paragraph would be this is a web page layout and we close off the paragraph tag and then slash body slash it's table doctor declaration used by the web browser to understand the version of html used in the document slash doc type html older html versions was sgml based and requires a reference to the dtd doc type html public w3c slash slash dtd slash uh, xhtml 1.2 transitional en this used to be the previous older versions of html this used to be the path name and you have to like you have to define all this to uh, declare the doc type which is now which now has been enhanced to just this much 
exclamation mark doc type HTML and doc type needs to be in uppercase. I remember. Next would be the basic tags in web, uh, web document. These are the elements. HTML a root element of an HTML page head uh, represents the document header title. Title would be meant. Uh, it, it is to mention the document title. Meta provides metadata about the HTML document like character encoding, page description, or keywords. Body represents the document's body and contains the visible page content. Thank you for watching. See you in the next video. Please remember to like and share. Hi,